Welcome to Style with Audrey. Today we're styling slouchy jeans. I recently picked up two pairs of slouchy jeans from Zara. The first pair is what I am wearing right now, and I also have a classic mid-wash denim pair. I haven't decided which pair to keep, so I still have the tags on, but today I will share with you 10 different ways that I style these jeans. The first look involves a classic bodysuit. By this point, I'm sure that a lot of us have heard of this infamous Zara bodysuit. I discovered it a few months ago Go, and I could not stop wearing this because it's so comfortable. It's really flattering because of how it cuts pretty deep on the side so it doesn't make your shoulder look too broad. I like that a tight bodysuit really helps balance with the bagginess of these slouchy jeans. I also love the black and white contrast. I think it's really classic and timeless. I just paired everything with a simple black belt. Another trend this season is belts with square buckles. And this one is from Zara, but a lot of shops do these belts. At the bottom, I'm just wearing these Bottega dupes from Zara that I featured in a recent Zara shoe haul. I love that these mules have snakeskin print, which makes the outfit more interesting because I am wearing just classic black and white, and they are really comfortable to walk around in. I think the key with styling slouchy jeans is to make sure that you cuff the bottom so that your ankle is on show. So right now I have my bottoms cuffed, but just to show you a comparison, I'm going to uncuff one leg. This side instantly makes my leg much shorter because the jean is quite long. It hits pretty much right below my ankle. However, if you do cuff the bottom, your legs will look instantly longer just because of your ankles on show. Changing up the previous outfit just a little bit, you have a completely different look. So what I did was taking off the belt from the previous look and added a wrap cardigan. This one is also from Zara. It is so cozy and I love the wrap detail so that it again helps accentuate the waist. So even though the cardigan is a little bit loose fitting and the jeans are a bit baggy, because you did accentuate the waist, you still have a very good proportion in terms of your outfit. And I thought to elongate the legs even more, I swapped for my Zara mesh heels. They are just a perfect pair of shoes that literally goes with any type of outfit from dressier to more casual outfits. I love how the pointy heels elevate the jeans so that they almost look like just a pair of loose fitting white pants. For this next look, all I did was swapping up my top. I opting for this organza sleeve top that also is current season from Zara. I talked about how I love pop sleeves or balloon sleeves so many times on this channel, but I do think that they are just such a statement that is really, really easy to wear and fits a lot of different body types. I love the color pairing of a more dusty pink with a creamy white, and I kept my mesh heels on because I thought the heels pair really well with the top. This is a great kind of going out or shopping outfit. You can even wear it in the workplace because the colors are so neutral. If you are a petite girl, I really think this outfit gives out the illusion that you have really long legs and really, really short torso. I personally love a white on white look. Now, I don't really mind that the top isn't the exact same of white as the bottom. I just think that it even accentuates the different texture of my top and bottom. So I kept everything at the bottom again the same because this is just a fail proof solution for slouchy jeans which is to pair them with pointy heels because you know that they will help you elongate the legs. And on top I have this really cool collared pop sleeve white shirt that has interesting kind of jewel tone buttons. I think that this really dresses up the outfit. I love that this outfit is of the same color. This is another trick for petite girls to look taller, which is to wear monochromatic outfits. This outfit is 
super casual and really, really cool. I swap out my shoes for these white platform combat boots that I picked up from Bershka recently. I love the um, almost like transparent, really, really high platforms. They're really comfortable, but they give you the high boots, which is what all of us petite girls want. For the jeans, I cuff the bottom even more so that you can still see a little bit of my skin. And I think this again helps make your legs look longer. On top, I just have one of my favorite sweatshirts. I actually have a video styling this sweatshirt five different ways. For this outfit, I simply tuck the front under my bra so that it creates almost a cropped sweatshirt look. I think this little bit of skin on show will also make your legs look even longer. We're all about showing just a little bit of skin and you will be surprised how much longer it makes your legs look. Along the lines of casual outfits, I now swapped for the mid-washed slouchy jeans and kept my combat boots on, but on top, I am just wearing this super, super bright lime green neon tank top that is a little bit cropped. So again, you see a little bit of the skin. I love the pop of color or more specifically pop of neon color paired with a classic denim shade and we want the top to be as short as we can so that the legs will look as long as possible. This outfit might be a little bit unexpected but I love the girliness of the top paired with a more kind of boyish sporty chunky combat boots. The base layer is this dotted mesh top that I picked up from YesStyle and on top I have this really really pretty lace cami that I'm sure a lot of you already have in your wardrobe. I love the layered look. I like how girly it feels and I just tucked everything in the slouchy jeans. This is such a classic outfit but with a little bit of a twist on top. Next one is a cool girl outfit. I have a oversized t-shirt that I got from Everling. By the way, they make the most comfortable t-shirts. I bought it in the size large so it looks more oversized and I basically just tucked it into the jeans and cut the sleeves to make it a little bit more girly and paired a belt, the same belt that I used before. I love to dress up a seemingly casual outfit. I think that's a formula to create cool outfits is to wear something that is super basic, super casual, but add a little bit of detail like your belt or your shoes to make it more put together. Also, I think black and classic denim color just goes so well together and instantly makes our outfit look expensive. Next outfit is simply pairing your jeans with a classic white shirt. Now the twist here is to make your white shirt into almost like a wrap shirt. I saw this on Pinterest the other day and I thought this is such a genius idea. Essentially, do not button any of the buttons on your classic white shirt. You simply kind of twist and wrap around the front bit so that it creates the illusion that you are wearing a wrap shirt. And I think something that is wrapped just instantly makes your outfit look more expensive and different than, you know, a classic button-down shirt. This last outfit pretty much breaks all of the fashion rules and all those tips and tricks that I was sharing earlier for you to look taller. But it still looks flattering because I folded in my sweater so it creates a fake waistline. Even though I am wearing my sweater baggy, my shirt baggy, my pants baggy, because the sweater is folded pretty much above my belly button. It makes it look like my legs start from here and doesn't matter if it's baggy on the bottom because my waistline is heightened, my legs would look longer. And of course, the universal rule of slouchy jean is a heel and especially if you're wearing a heel make sure that it is pointy ideally matches with your skin tone just because now it looks like your legs are extended to basically the point of your heel give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy watching it and leave a comment down below on your favorite outfit out of these 10 outfits if you want to see more fashion content i make two new videos every single week and i will see you in the next one Bye.